guys. Um, about to hit 200k on my car. I don't know if you can see that. Hopefully you can. Somehow, somehow you can see it. But uh, yeah, so we're probably gonna hit it today, and uh, that's uh, that's how we'll start today, I guess. But before that, I gotta take a pee. Oh my god, that was like the dirtiest toilet ever. That was disgusting. Uh, and one of them was broken. Car life in these gas stations. But uh, so currently on Uber Eats, as soon as I had to take a leak, there was a, an order that I missed. So um, yeah, so just gotta like, I guess patiently wait and uh, whoever's gonna be our 200K delivery will uh, We'll get, we'll do. But yeah, I don't know how I feel. I'm just trying to. Uber All right, so that was 192. That was only like a half a mile away, which isn't bad. Eight miles to go. On to our next one. So I guess we'll just uh, wait here until we get another order. Six miles to go. Six. How do you do six like this or like this? But uh, yeah, that last delivery was weird. It was like super far to get to the restaurant. I went to the wrong one. <laughs> and then uh, yeah, and then she was like a half a mile away. Could have just walked, pretty much. No, I kind of like some things on Uber Eats and something on some things on DoorDash. Like Uber Eats is like the app is way better. The app is so much better, and it's just more like clean and doesn't lag or glitch or everything's like way better. And then DoorDash just has so many things going on. Like you got Google Maps integrated, and it always lags. It's always like sometimes like the pin is always off and wrong. And uh, but. Um, yeah, and there's like all these buttons and it has to keep like a theme like uh, it has to keep the DoorDash theme And I hate that <laughs> But I think DoorDash still pays better so far. It's cool to just turn on Uber Eats and then see what happens but um, DoorDash is a little more consistent and uh, you know Better in the area So to speak, but it's more like oh you must have this rating you must have this and this and this so I don't know how I feel about Either one. It's like two orders: tropical smoothie uh, sandwiches or whatever, and then uh, some more sandwiches. The bag accidentally ripped, so hopefully it's hopefully it's okay. When uh, I was picking it up, and we're currently at 199.998, so we're definitely gonna. Guys, we hit it, and I still have a few more uh, miles to drop these suckers off. So, uh, yeah, speech coming soon. Thanks for all the support.
All right, I gotta do this quick before another freaking desert blizzard rolls in and I can't get up the ski slopes of a hill. So, uh, so you know, 200K, obviously, if you guys have been here uh, with me, you know that I've replaced a lot, especially tires and, uh, you know, a lot of other maintenance things, tires, that wheel that we had to <laughs> get, oh my God, and then the serpentine belt that we just did uh batteries just a whole ton of stuff so i'm sure there's more to come um that being said i'm gonna have to replace these two cd axles mainly this one because it pops yeah and then uh i'll have to uh uh adjust the valves on the engine and um yeah, I don't know what else is next. Maybe like a, a coolant flush. But um, yeah, not bad. I mean, I'm thankful so far. But I really want to keep it in good shape to keep it going. And uh, obviously keep my life going. And whatever else. Also, the number of times I've been hit in the back. And in the front. So I decided to take a quick break from dashing, door dashing to uh, since like the storm's coming in to do some laundry real quick and uh, get that stuff done for tomorrow. It's cool. Some clothes done. Um, dang, my organization's terrible in my car. Like honestly, could uh, could have used another shirt or something like that in the laundry. But then get back to door dashing. This guy like has no idea what lane he's in. He's like trying to follow the bike line. <laughs> bike lane. Oh my god, now he's in the right lane. He's probably not even gonna turn. What the frick? Should I call the cops or something? Oh my god. So what's next? Uh, I don't know, just fix up my car and keep going. That's pretty much the plan. Just to keep my car on the road. And car life going, I guess. Uh, I want to go to other states in other uh, locations but right now I can't uh, I just can't do it right now so hopefully eventually and just keep expanding life and growing and whatnot and getting more jobs more money and more everything you know that's life right you just keep growing so that's that's what's next fix those things and then fix that and just keep fixing stuff <laughs> so uh, it's supposed to snow tonight, a little bit, or maybe, I don't know. It looked like it was, but then it just kind of like stopped, so I'll keep you guys posted on that. Thanks for watching, thanks for tuning in. Uh, make sure you like and subscribe, and let me know if you got any questions or anything. Car life or whatever related. So, see you next time, guys.
this is what I woke up to. More Colorado like freaking snow. Just buried in it. I don't know where my scraper is. What the frick? This is why I go to Arizona or freaking Vegas for a winter. 